Hi and welcome to Belgian Die Cast Restorations. I'm Johan and on the turntable we have the Majorat number 245 Savium Tanker Truck. This is my contribution for the October challenge of the Diecast and Mals community. The challenge is called More Than 4 and the aim is to restore or refresh, you guessed it, any vehicle that has more than 4 wheels. Savium started out in 1955 with the fusion of Renault and two other French truck manufacturers. This resulted in the Société Anonyme de Véhicules Industriels et Équipements Mécaniques, Savium in short, translated as a limited corporation for industrial vehicles and mechanical equipment. Savium built mainly trucks and buses. They first cooperated with German truck manufacturer Henschel and later with Mann, which also resulted in the Europe Cap for their SM truck line introduced in 1967, which this majorette model is based on. The cab design was also used by MAN trucks and MAN in turn delivered the engine for use in the Savium trucks. The SM truck line was discontinued in 1977 and the last Savium truck, the PS30T, was produced in 1979. From 1980 on, Renault started building trucks under its own brand name. Majot introduced this tanker truck in 1975 with Shell livery, followed by Texaco, Golf, Aral and the Swiss oil company Avia. In 1982 the truck was also produced with Ewing oil livery of the TV series Dallas, coinciding with Majorette's short-lived introduction in the US market. The truck on the turntable is blue and the tank has some orange remains, which is evidence that this once was a golf tanker. But it's in a very shabby state, with flaking paint, misty windows, bent axles and the chrome on the wheels is all but gone. I'm planning to restore this one back to original for the challenge with some minor extra detailing. So let's get out the tools and give this model a factory reset.
This very shabby Majorette Saviem tanker truck is my contribution to the more than 4 challenge of the Dacos and Moles community. Based on the 1967 Europe Cap trucks designed by Saviem, the truck is thoroughly play-worn, with chipped paint, bent axles, misty scratch windows and missing decals. And here is our tanker truck after restoration. I used Samia TS15 blue, which is close to the dark blue of the original. The windows are polished, the wheels cleaned, resprayed and rechromed, and the damaged front wheels were replaced. The extra detailing on the cap really makes this truck look a lot better than just a factory reset. The tanker was sprayed gloss white and I attached the decals I made based on the measurements of the tank and pictures from the internet. You can download my vector files for these decals from my Kofi page. If you enjoy my videos, please give me a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and tick the notification bell. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.